Hi, everyone. I am Corn Dan. I'm here with the greatest, worst fighting game you'll ever see in your entire life. Uh, this is Battle of the Eras, a game started in 1995 by literally three 14 year olds. I hope you love it. I'm here with my uh, my couch, uh, Wobbly Python. Hi. And Ryudo. How do you do, y'all? Who will help us uh, figure out this game. <laughs> it is a mystery to all. Yeah, I was going to say, that was a pretty big promise. <laughs> <laughs> so, we're gonna be reaching here we'll be here that's all we have <laughs> yeah 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 we'll, we'll, we'll do our best here um this is a fmv fighting game and and they did all of the work three 14 year olds they did all the motion capture all the graphics all of the sound all of everything i straight up love this game and it's quite the experience now we're gonna start off with um the best fighter is shadow snake um shadow snake is some one of the other guy's little brother uh, and and he's great because he's also probably um, broken. So we'll get started. Three, two, one, go. <laughs> <laughs> you were so excited to start the game, you forgot to start the timer. You love yeah. to see it. I know. I love right? egg shaped earth. I love <laughs> egg shaped earth. I can't get over it. I'm it's sorry. It's excellent. It's excellent. It's excellent. <laughs> All right, so, Gordon Dan, bring us in with some with, knowledge. With the Minotaur, the the Minotaur, they tried to do. Um, motion capture like claymation and it didn't really work right the minotaur wasn't going to hold up so we're going to go fight the minotaur um turns out he's a worm <laughs> surprise <laughs> so when you have worms in your, your minotaurs <laughs> we're, we're gonna right this game has has one real strategy um and that's crotch kick them until they they give in um, <laughs> because because Shadow Snake has a two-frame animation. He ends up being the best character because it doesn't even knock them back. So you can sit here and crotch kick them, and that's easier than trying to do all the special moves. Yeah, that's right. And there is a reason for that, and if you want me to, I can get into that corn yeah, game real absolutely. quickly. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, yeah. So the big reason is, we did mention this earlier, and this is like positively said. This was made by three 14-year-olds. They did all the capture, all the story writing, all, you know, the uh, programming and whatnot. But at the same time, that meant that they had limited amount of time to make uh, some of these uh, items. So the characters who are the best in the game are the most incomplete characters. So Shadow Snake is the younger brother, and you'll see this character later, of XLX. And they were babysitting him for one night. And so they said, hey, do you want to be in the game? And they, absolutely, when you were a kid, you want to be in the game. So they had one night to do all the capture for this kid. And then once they were done, they were like, well, that's all the animation we've got. So you have two frames of a kick. You're, all your animations are messed up. And you're the fastest character in the game because we don't have to do all this filler stuff. I, I do want to point out something I really appreciate with all the motion capture they did. There are the death animations in round one and round two are different for every single character. Yeah, I like, love that level of detail, actually. They put in so much work into this and it's great. Now, you know, we haven't talked about the plot and that's because it doesn't make much sense. Um, the, the best that we can <laughs> talk about is this guy, Temporis, and we'll see Temporis later, um, has time travel and picked up all these characters from across the ages, across the eras, Right, and putting us in a um, basically fighting championship, and he's going to extract the DNA of whoever wins to like try to save the human race in a hundred thousand AD. <laughs> History, it turns out, is also a lot wilder than we presently are taught in schools. There's all sorts of like elves and minotaur worms, and you know, just wild things that have existed apparently throughout the past, future, present. <laughs> We're learning here. These are facts. This is history, everyone. This is, this is a history lesson. All at the same time that we're seeing these toe tags happen. It's, it's absolutely a great revisionist history. <laughs> we're really exploring the tarsal meta, as it were. <laughs> yeah, we're going foot loose out here. <laughs> uh, but he's still good. Good job from Cordan, you know, hitting that stance as we were wolves and everything. So we're getting to the next stage here. And I think this is time. No, no. Maybe I'm going early. This might be our favorite character, though. Oh, uh, is it, is it? No, this is Farrakhan. No, 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 this is Farrakhan. I'm, oh, I'm looking for XLX action because yeah, that's that our favorite character. Farrakhan, then Gatekeeper, then XLX. So, okay. The other thing you can watch out for, right, and you'll really see it with XLX and um, Gatekeeper, is that 
they did all of this with whatever they had, right? Mm -hmm. And so that may mean that, you know, like, look for things like pipe insulation, like some Halloween, like, axe, um, an original super soaker. Noodle. Cool noodle. <laughs> <Cool> noodle. <laughs> <laughs> it's amazing that they were able to just like grab all together and just create these characters. Like once again, when we say it's made by 14 year olds, it's legitimately just the most amazing creative thing to ever just get produced by a group and, of kids. I'm, that, they I'm did, legitimately always impressed. They did this in 1995, right? Mm -hmm. Where they wrote their own like extended memory handler for DOS. Um, they, you know, they adapted like all of the sound stuff and everything to it, right? Like seriously, the level of effort that they put into this is amazing. Um, and the main things of hey, hey, Ryudo, how many copies did this sell? Uh, let me just uh, pull up the calculator here because I have a lot of charts over here and uh, hmm. all these charts say huh? zero. Zero oh. copies were sold. Oh, oh no. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> how could this be? Yeah. But that is that is facts. So they, they sold zero copies, uh, which is a shame because I actually legitimately really like this. It's yeah. not the world's best game, but it is a great social experience. And I'm glad I, we're sharing yes. it all with you today. We, yes, we all yes. say that we would like worse games made by fewer people with less money that, you know, cost the same. And this really speaks to that attitude. I am mm -hmm. such a fan of this. It's got the indie spirit. <laughs> it's beautiful. It really does. Yeah, it has that very indie spirit before, like, you know, indie games were really, really like, truly, like, an expected thing, I guess, is the best way to put oh, it. Oh, here's, here's <laughs> XLX. Even, yes, here's oh, XLX. Yeah. All right, Chad, if we're lucky, if we're lucky, we'll get to see the ultimate weapon from XLX. It has too many frames of animation, but you'll see the first frames of the Super Soaker. <laughs> I'm so it's excited. It's a particle for the rifle. Super it's a particle particle <laughs> rifle. <It's fine. laughs> oh, sorry, excuse me. Right, right. Particle rifle. The particles just happen to be water mostly. Yeah. <laughs> see, you oh, can see the worst game. Oh, game. oh, you are blessed today. Congratulations. <laughs> <laughs> we saw the first few frames before he got put loose. <laughs> this is the best here. game. It, no, yes, it, it, it's, seriously, right. it's seriously amazing. <laughs> 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 oh, Nicole, you're you're around. Ooh, okay. I have a. You know what? We're gonna get to the hardest part of yeah. this challenge here. <laughs> yeah. We're gonna get to the hardest part of this challenge here. And, and it's so and we're it's about, not hard we're, for us. It's gonna yeah, be hard for not you. for us. <laughs> okay. Yeah, it's hard for you, Nicole. We have so a we're challenge. about to hit the final boss here. So uh -huh. the biggest challenge is here. I want you to read as many donations as you can before the game is over. Get ready for that time yeah, call. You got a couple Go. minutes. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Oh my gosh, okay. Well, I've got $5 from Mono Green. Awful Block is best block. I am so hype. It is the best block, and this is the best game. I actually oh, have thanks. a really cool uh, dev donation from the previous run, $250 from Tenen Steelian. Ooh. Hi there, I'm the developer of Salamander County Public Television. Thanks to Teddy Ross for an awesome speed run of my game and Tie Tuesday for the commentary. It's super cool to see my game in a GDQ. Well, SCP TV has only been on stream Steam so far. I'm excited to announce that as of this GDQ run, it's now available on all major consoles. Check it out if you like what you saw and want to know what that guy had a giant vacuum attached to his mouth. Thanks again, and I'm looking forward to the rest of the marathon. Yes, that's beans. <laughs> as, as someone who didn't see the previous run, I, the, the phrase why that guy had a giant vacuum attached to his mouth really speaks to me on a spiritual level. <laughs> um, and I, I do want to know more. Thank you. We definitely uh, have, I have for a, a couple more. Perfect. Oh, yeah. $25 from Chanzilla that says, whoop, whoop, awful block. I, you know, yes. $50 from Anonymous. There is no comment, but Anonymous, thank you so much. I have $50 from Namarsil. So I fall asleep on Pokemon and wake up on awful block. That's amazing. That is amazing. Welcome. Welcome to this. <laughs> I have $100 from Mooware that says, Beeras. Thank you yes. for your donation. I agree. I still like, I'm shocked that I was promised the worst fighting game, but instead I got the best fighting game. Like that was a plot twist that I wasn't expecting to have happen. Um, I have $50 from the Valiant Sun. No comment. Thank you so much for your donation. Are we Are we just kicking? What are we? Yeah, we're, we're, oh we're, yeah, yeah. They're definitely eating some shin on a shingle right we, now. We, so, we, don't, you know. we don't know what Tim Forrest turned into, but that's time, by the way. <laughs> that's time. <laughs> Performing the broomless sweep. Yeah. <laughs> All right. You did, you did eight donations I counted, so I will also do $10 per donation you read during that section. So I will be donating $8 here in a bit. Uh, so, okay. so we did it, guys. Un unfortunately, what we did was traveled back in time, like 
4.4 billion years, um, blow up the dome that we were in. We sucked up all the hydrogen from the sun, blew it up, and we just accidentally killed all humans because the sun never started up. Oops. I I'm Whoops. sorry, guys. Oops. We, we did it. <laughs> You hate when that happens. You know, sometimes your hand slips and you just restart the sun. History <laughs> <laughs> wild? Failed to restart the sun? Yeah. 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 Oops, my bad. So, <laughs> Sorry, uh, y'all. <laughs> that's that's Battle of the Eras. Uh, I highly recommend this. You can go find it online. The, the, the devs have released it, the full game for free for everyone. It's a lot of fun. Uh, I'd like to say, you know, thank you to my couch, um, while we Python and Ryudo, right, for helping out here, make it feel like a real fighting game. <laughs> and, you know, big shout out. It is a real fighting game. Big I'll shout out to the whole fighting game. All the awful game community, um, you know, for being supportive of all this and and flooding like everything of mine of the Barris right now. Thank you all. And that's it. So, um, given that, we can kick it back to the hosts for the next game. Thank you. So that was that was a joy and a pleasure <laughs> to be able to witness. I am very glad I was awake to see that. Thank you so, so much. I have a $50 donation from some egrets. Shout out to bird friends. Get those seeds. Uh, thank you so much for your donation, some egrets. Twitch chat. Stretch. Get some water. Stand up. Walk around a little bit. We're going to go on to a break, and I will see you very, very soon.
Welcome back, Twitch chat, to Awesome Games Done Quick 2023. How are you all doing on this fine good morning, evening, afternoon, wherever you may be? I have a $50 donation from Ty Tuesday that says, that was beans. Thank you so much for your... There's, there's so many beans. Uh, I have 